The Indian Premier League, the second richest league in the world in terms of per match value, a sporting extravaganza which attracts the world's top cricketers and is valued in billions. The nail-biting 20-over format produces adrenaline rushing moments, but it's also a bookmaker's dream arena. In 2013, after a betting racket came to the fore, two top franchises, Chennai and Rajasthan, had to face two-year-long suspensions. However, since then, due to multi-million dollar contracts and strict vigilance, the game has remained immune to the lure of betting. But that has not stopped mischievous minds from making money out of it. Hold it. This revelation could make you sit at the edge of your seat. Quite like watching the last over of an IPL match. Necessity, they say, is the mother of all innovations. But punters in India's western state of Gujarat have given the phrase a whole new meaning. Police have arrested four people for staging fake IPL matches. You heard that right. Their targets were sitting about 4,500 kilometers away in Moscow. The so-called organizers made local laborers dress up as cricketers. Four high-definition cameras were set up to provide sleek camera angles, wearing jerseys of their fake teams playing on a proper cricket pitch. As players of Chennai fighters took on Gandhinagar challengers and an empire adjudicating the match to complete the elaborate hopes. The match was live streamed on YouTube and bets were collected in real time via Telegram group. The empires, who rather look more enthusiastic during the game, were also doubling up as a bookie. They kept passing on instructions to the players to perform or perish, depending on the instructions they were given on the walkie-talkie sets received from the organizers. The fake cricket league continued its bizarre act, duping punters in Russian cities. The tournament progressed into the quarter-finals, but some locals who were playing the matches became suspicious and approached the local police after they were asked to throw away their wickets and thus the entire scam was busted. This is surely going to go down as one of the most ingenious and offbeat modes of crime. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.